Hi everybody, this is Joni, Crafty Girl 63, um, coming on today to show you what I got in the mail. Um, I guess you could maybe call this my new Happy Mail. I don't really know what the definition of Happy Mail is, but um, this was mailed to me and it did make me very happy, so I'm going to call it Happy Mail. Um, I went on um, this site that one of my subscribers told me about. Um, the person who has the page, her name is Crafty Lori. That's her um, the name of her channel. And you can go on her channel. She has um, one page that um, you can ask for wishes. Um, if there's something that you don't have that, that you would like, maybe um, some more stickers, some washi, some, I, I don't even know, but nothing huge like you can't ask for you know a Sizzix um, machine or a Cricut you know you can ask for um, small things you know like embellishment kind of things um, anyway so uh, I went on that channel because I would like to buy the gorgeous girls by Santoro and um, I, I just you know I, I can only find them online so I would like to kind of see them, you know, um, this, um, this woman, Reza, answered me and she sent me, um, she sent me the stamped images because that's what I asked for. I asked for um, stamped images and um, now the, the address label says Terry, so I'm not sure, was it Terry or Reza? Or maybe they share um, a YouTube name. I'm not sure. But um, whichever one it was of them, I'm so grateful. So I went on and I asked for two things. And I don't even remember what the other thing was. But um, what I really wanted was the gorgeous girls. And um, these are the min the minis, and which is actually what I wanted. Um, I do see them on Blitzy a lot inexpensive I've looked at them on Amazon and they're more expensive but it's hard when you're shopping online to get an idea of um, you know what exactly the size is so, um, so it was so great that I you know someone was kind enough to answer my wish so you can grant a wish or ask her a wish and there's also another um, page that crafty Lori has that um, is also for um, if you want new subscribers. So if you just do a search for Crafty Lori, you'll see. But so that's how I got to that page. One of my subscribers told me about it. And then um, this um, Reza or Terry um, sent me this in the mail and it came all the way from, where did it come from? South Carolina. That's like 12 hours or more away from me. Um, but look at how beautiful. So she packaged it in this, and um, then she sent it in this. And this looks like it could be like packaging from, you know, stickers or something. What a great idea. You know, so if it rains, um, it doesn't get wet. So she made me this beautiful card. Isn't that gorgeous? That's a handmade flower on there with a flat back pearl in it. And um, this just slides off. And look at the scallop here. This must be glue dots she put on there to kind of keep that in place or something to keep the band in place. But look at the scalloped edge on this envelope. I have never seen that before. Gorgeous. So um, I opened it up and I was, it felt thicker than it should have been for some stamped images. And the first thing, so it comes like this in there. And um, look at this. This is one of the gorgeous girls. She sent me a little charm of the uh, gorgeous girls. How beautiful is that? I mean, that was so kind and so generous. Thank you so much. And then I got... Um, she cut she not only stamped these out but cut them out with a die cut and oh, just beautiful look at that one and it does say here 
gorgeous girl. I mean, it says um, Santoro. Gorgeous. That's what it says underneath the tiny little letters. But look at her, how pretty. I love this collection. Um, so she sent me that one. And then, I mean, how I was not expecting them to be cut out so fancy for me. Look at that one with the umbrella. It, this brings me back to when I was a kid, and they used to call it a bubble umbrella. It was a clear umbrella, and it kind of, it wasn't like a straight-looking umbrella. It kind of came down like in a little dome over your head, and you could look out and see through the plastic umbrella where you were going. They used to call them bubble, bubble umbrellas. Cute. And, um, and then there's this one. So... I was only expecting maybe like these three, not cut out with a die cut, just stamped on a piece of um, paper. And she cut them out with this beautiful scallop die cut. She sent me this charm and then there's more. I mean, just how generous to take the time to do all of this. Stamp them, cut them, package them so beautifully. Put them in a homemade, um, you know, a handmade envelope. Um, so there's more. So she sent me this one. And a duplicate of that. She sent me this one. Isn't that gorgeous? The hat and scarf. The little mushrooms and her little, looks like uh, her dress is hanging out from her little coat. Um, and this is the duplicate of that one. And then she sent me this one. There's a little cup of tea sitting on the floor next to her with a mouse poking his head out. That is just beautiful. And like, I'm just thinking of these for cards or tags or like there's so many things you can do with them. Stamp them in your planner. I mean, I just think they're gorgeous. And what a fun way, you know, to um, learn coloring and shading, you know, that on these. And this is the last one. And duplicates of this as well. This one is so cute. Look, she's holding feathers in her hand. She's got a heart beret in her hair. And she's got um, an owl on her arm. How cute is that? little hearts on her are they socks or shoes I mean how cute and if you notice in every one of them I don't know if that's like a um, trademark thing but the girls all have like striped tights on I just noticed that now but what what really um, great details in these and that's it guys so um yeah if there is something that you don't have and you would like to see before you purchase it um you know or see the size or because i really wanted to see the size and these look like they're probably one maybe three inches in height maybe probably if you go to the description in the store it'll tell you but you can, it's hard to see you know not in person so, like, this is the size of, looks like a standard card. And that's the image. So, just to give you some kind of an idea. Um, so, um, thank you again so much, Reza or, and Terry. Um, I, I just, I'm keeping all of this because I think everything, there's so much thought put into everything um, when... I'm a complete and total stranger, and um, he just went on there and did this for me. So um, thank you so much, and um, for my subscribers, um, go visit that site. Um, you know, there might be something that um, you might like that someone else has that they could share with you, um, and or you might be so blessed to have so many things that you could grant someone's wish wish what a nice thing to do and um so thank you so much for coming to watch my video today um on my staying at home sick day um and 
and please come again. And for anyone who's new to my channel, hit the subscribe button. Um, we have a great group of gals here, lots of ideas to share, and they're all little cheerleaders. They all come on and compliment each other and make suggestions and, um, you know, you email back and forth and exchange things. And um, I'm really glad to be part of um, the YouTube crafting community. Thank you guys. Good night.